Today, LinkedIn finally gets a proper business manager, the maturation of the LinkedIn bio industry, why social shoppers aren't converting, YouTube's plans for live shopping, and grid pinning on Instagram is finally here. It's Wednesday, June 8th. I'm Steph Gunn filling in for Todd Maffin. Here is what you missed today in digital marketing. LinkedIn is growing up before our very eyes. Today, the company announced it has finally launched a business manager, a centralized platform that puts the management of your people, campaigns, and company pages in one place. The LinkedIn business manager can let you view and manage your company pages, add accounts, your team, and business partners all from one platform, manage and control admin tasks like permissions and billing, and share and update matched audiences. Since business manager is a broad tool, you'll be able Able to do that across accounts. LinkedIn says its business manager will be launching in the coming weeks. While LinkedIn is giving marketers more tools to manage their business on the platform, it also announced today that it's rolling out new engagement options. First, a new product listing showcase on your profile. This will let you highlight products and projects you've worked on as a sub-element in your experience listings, according to Social Media Today. Links will also lead to corresponding product pages on your company profile, but before you can add a product to your profile, it must first be listed on your company page. LinkedIn's also updating newsletters with a new option to include both at mentions and hashtags in newsletters and articles. The platform also said that you can include hashtags in your articles to enrich your content and help readers discover your content. Finally, LinkedIn is adding the capacity for company page admins to respond as their brand to any post in the app. Similar to on Facebook, admins will see an account switcher option when they go to respond to a post in the app. Let's just hope that LinkedIn LinkedIn's version of this, you know, works. Linktree has launched a new directory that makes it easier for you to find apps and integrations you can add to your brand's profile. The Link and Bio platform today announced it is launching Linktree Marketplace. The company says it will provide brands with more purchases, views, streams, bookings, and more. Linktree also introduced Link Apps, which integrate more than 30 of Linktree partners' digital services directly within users' landing pages, including social media pages, shopping, gaming launches, NFT galleries, and more. Linktree's integration partners include PayPal, Reddit, Cameo, and others. A new study is reinforcing what you probably already know. Your brand can't afford to sleep on social commerce. The survey found that more than a third of consumers have purchased something on social media and would do it again. Nine out of ten consumers are aware of brand social media pages, and only one in ten actively avoid brand social media pages. Despite consumers increasing interest in social commerce, there are still a couple of barriers preventing online shoppers from converting. First, nearly 40% said that they haven't made a purchase directly through a social media platform because they don't trust the security of their payment information, while almost a quarter said it's because they are worried they will never receive their purchase. As privacy and shipping remain the two biggest areas of concern, the study suggests education on social commerce is still needed. The study was done by Mintel. This podcast runs on two things, caffeine and Zapier. Zapier lets you connect more than 4,000 of the most popular apps marketers use every day, like Google Sheets, Slack, and Facebook lead ads, to automate almost any workflow imaginable. Here's how we use it. Someone signs up for a premium podcast membership, a little celebration thingy goes off in our Slack, and they get added to our MailChimp. If they signed up for an annual subscription, they used to set up a video recording in Bonjoro and added a task in Todoist for me to send them a personalized welcome video. When we're doing the story lineup, each story we shortlist gets sent to a Google Sheet for archiving. Zapier is as easy as telling it, when this happens, then do this. And Zapier has thousands of easy-to-use templates so you can get started fast. See for yourself why teams at Airtable, Dropbox, HubSpot, and this very podcast use Zapier every day to automate their businesses. Try Zapier for free today at zapier.com slash digital. That's Z-A-P-I-E-R dot com slash digital. Think about a bicycle. It takes balance to get where you want to go. Now think about business. 
Whatever your business or organization, you ride the line between numbers and people. Just like the bike, it takes balance. CLA, CPAs, consultants, and wealth advisors. That's CLA. We'll get you there. Clifton Larson Allen LLP. Investment advisory services are offered through Clifton Larson Allen Wealth Advisors LLC, an SEC registered investment advisor. For its part, YouTube is doubling down on social commerce and will broadcast some new live shopping shows during its Beauty Fest event. And this year's Beauty Festival will be the first where consumers can shop what they see directly in the live stream. Along with shoppable streams, the platform has secured some of the industry's biggest influencers to market the event, including Hailey Bieber, Gwen Stefani, Ashley Graham, and more. YouTube will also be testing a new monetization feature for shorts that could be a massive marketing opportunity for brands brands if it's rolled out. Beginning today, the beauty brand Glossier will launch a new product exclusively on shorts, and fans will use the hashtag written in Glossier to participate. YouTube said every short created with the hashtag will be shoppable using the link directly on the video. The TikTokification of Instagram continues, with the meta-owned platform announcing it is launching grid pinning. Accounts can now pin up to three posts to the top of their profile grid, including reels, just like on TikTok. To curate your grid, click on the three dots in the top right corner of a post or reel and select pin to your profile. Here's a lesson in testing your creative with a small focus group before buying ad space for it. Adweek reports that a TV ad in the UK has been banned after it received over 60 complaints. The campaign, which aimed to convince viewers to go vegan, featured images of animals alongside three adults eating meat, intercut with video footage of animals waiting to face death. It took me less than seven seconds to turn off the ad. Todd wants me to apologize for the ad interrupting the middle of yesterday's show. In his defense, usually I upload the podcast and then insert the ad. So what happened was he missed a step and that's why it played in the middle of the show. But I've been off for the past five days, so I don't know, maybe technically it's my fault. So I was off, I hosted my best friend's bachelorette party. Everything went great. You know, bachelorette parties are for sure very different in your 30s than they are in your 20s. And I think that that's the last bachelorette party out of all of my friends, so I'm a little relieved believe that I never have to plan one ever again. Although one of my friends did ask for a divorce party. Don't forget the premium version of this podcast is just like this one, but with no ads, access to deep dive weekend episodes, replays of our live events, better audio quality, story links in the show notes, and more. You can get $30 off the annual plan by going to todayindigital.com slash premium feed or tap the link in the show notes. Thanks for listening. I'll talk to you tomorrow. Think about a bicycle. It takes balance to get where you want to go. Now think about business. Whatever your business or organization, you ride the line between numbers and people. Just like the bike, it takes balance. CLA, CPAs, consultants, and wealth advisors. That's CLA. We'll get you there. Clifton Larson Allen LLP. Investment advisory services are offered through Clifton Larson Allen Wealth Advisors LLC, an SEC registered investment advisor. First impressions are everything. And if you're looking to make an impact with your online content, you need Issue, the easiest way to make your creative ideas come to life. Create flipbooks, ebooks, menus, magazines, and so much more. Dust off your PDFs and start fresh with Issue. Visit issue.com slash radio. That's I-S-S-U-U dot com slash radio. And use code radio today and get 50% off an annual plan.